putting off paying your credit card debt, then it's time to change that. So if you have to borrow money from your family, use up the money you've been saving to buy that new smartphone, or if you have to, take a personal loan to pay off the bill. Whatever it takes to completely eliminate credit card debt. Interest rates have been trending downwards and are likely to continue to fall. So aside from an emergency fund, avoid keeping large sums of money in fixed deposits. Based on your financial goals, some other alternative investments that you could consider are equity or debt-based mutual funds, ELSS funds for your tax-saving investments, or the National Pension Scheme or NPS for your retirement corpus. An unforeseen medical emergency can drain out your entire savings. And yet, a majority of people do not have adequate health cover. One simple way to fix this is to opt for a personal health insurance over and above what your employer offers you. In fact, as a thumb rule, always opt for a personal health cover and don't depend on your employer's health cover alone. Leaving your tax planning for the last minute is something that should be avoided at any cost. To make the most of your tax saving investments, ensure that it is in sync with your financial portfolio and is earmarked for specific financial goals. Gold is a great investment to protect your portfolio from the risk of an economic crisis. However, in times of economic growth, gold does not give returns comparable to other avenues such as equity. So it's highly recommended not to be over-allocated to gold. 